Hi guys, welcome to another video by myself, Bates 87 It's the start of the month. It is Club Tour Day. Uh, we are going to be taking a look around the club, showing you what we've got, what we've not got, what we're missing, what we're looking to get. Um, even going to be running down some custom tactics, because I believe I have changed them slightly uh, from previous videos. Now, when it comes to custom tactics, boom. Do not take these as Bible. Do not take these as they're going to work instantly for you, because they probably won't. It depends on how you play, and uh, i just like to give you guys a little bit of an overview of what I've got, and then maybe you can test it out, see what the crack is, and uh, see if it does help you. Now, we're going to start off on the page for the La Liga team of the season. Um, these are the players we packed, and maybe one more as well, um, who we pack, we don't know. Uh, so you guys will have to check the video from yesterday, which was a guaranteed uh, La Liga pack. We may have packed one of these, who knows. Um, but up until now, we've got Sarabia to Stegens, Cazola Navas, um, Hermosa and Inglesias and Parejo. Um, that's what we've packed up until this point. In the Turkish team of the season, um, I'm basically going to have to buy these players. Uh, Trezeguet, Yilmaz, Sosa and Diagne. Um, or unless I get them as reds, who knows. But that's basically the rundown of what I need. When it comes to uh, rivals, we're looking at when we sat, sat rank 1 or rank 2 for this week. So we're going to get two ultimate packs. This week I'm not playing the weekend league. Reason I'm not playing the weekend league is I'm in LA play um, or at a, LA uh, 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 at EA play in LA. So uh, I were playing foot champions. I don't think even though I've got Sunday free, I may find somewhere to play, but we'll have to wait and see if, if that uh, comes through or not. I doubt it will. With the team we've got, what has happened to the team? You may ask. Like, has the team changed with team of season? Currently, it has not. It has not changed with team of the season. This is what we've got. Um, it's the same team as we've always got. You guys can see Mbappe uh, underneath, but it's mainly team of the years. Now, we have been messing around with the bench a little bit. We have got Goretzka, who come on as a sub. Um, Havertz as well, coming on as a sub. And uh, Van Dijk, I, oh, he played, he's played 10 games with him. And then we've got the uh, Pat Pulled Ebra, who actually does come up clutch. Now, by the time I play my next weekend league, the only thing which I can see potentially changing is that right-hand side, because Lala more than likely will get a team this season. It's looking like he will. Mbappe might get a striker version, and then I might have a play around. Like, I might put um, might put him there. I might have a change round. But Mbappe, I would love. Like, his stats, 1,041 games, 738 goals, and 434 assists. Um, we've also got Neymar as well. Uh, 1,018 games, 515 goals, and 388 assists. Ronaldo, the prime moments, Ronaldo, 568 games. 287 goals and 252 assists, and uh, Hullet as well, 697 games, 159 goals, and 334 assists. Do not get me wrong, even though I've got these players, not a fan of the way that he did prime moment icons this year. I thought it was a shambles, I thought it was a mess, and I thought it was a complete money grab as well. But what can you do, guys? going to roll with what he do. In the striker position, 1,071 appearances for Ronaldo. 1,253 goals and 626 assists. He is the best player on FIFA by a country mile. There is no one close to him, in my opinion. Um, he finishes shots he does, shouldn't. He's got five-star skills, four-star weak foot, and he does the business all the time. And uh, one of the reasons why I've kept him there. I don't think he's going to be a better player than him in the game. Like, even his team of season version, it'll be, a, it'll be the same rating, but it'll be, like, different... Different stat distribution, won't it? So, my record room is pretty good considering I don't play that much squad battles. Like, this is all rivals and champs, you know. So, um, I'm happy with him. Uh, Marcelo, I got a few assists on him recently because of uh, the new meta, which is LB crossing, uh, which is spamming it to the back post and then Mbappe gets the head. Uh, we've got Varane and Ramos. We did originally have Maldini in there as well, but I didn't like Maldini and I didn't like playing uh, Ramos at right back either. Um, so, that was the crack there. Custom tactics. We switched the team up to the 4 2 3 1 as our main uh, main mess. We've got pressure pressure on heavy touch. Width is. Um, I might actually try someone else's custom tactics out, you know, and see if that helps me. So we've got six and four on the defensive style. We're not on drop back. Offense, we've got balanced, and it goes from six, four, three, and two. And uh, the uh, formation as it runs out, as you can see there, guys. Neymar at left wing, Mbappe right wing, Ronaldo, Cam, Cristiano, striker, Modric, and Hullet as two box to box midfielders, which defend pretty well. 
And if you guys have played with that team, Leon Modric, defensively, he can be very, very annoying um, to try and get past because he's a little nippy player. Very similar to Kante, actually, uh, but maybe not. He actually offers more because he can actually shoot inside the box, whereas Kante, I've always found a little bit of a liability when it comes to that. Um, instructions, stay central, game behind, stay forward, uh, stay forward, stay forward, stay forward. Uh, cut passing in, stay back while attacking and cover centre. Same for Rude Hullet as well. And uh, the stay back while attacking on Lala. And balance attack on... Well, I might, I might change that as well. I might go stay back while attacking. And then just manually put him up. I don't know. We'll see if that works. And then Rolls basically Hullet's doing everything. I love him on corners. People say he's waste on corners. But he's got a lot of assists from there. So I cannot complain. So that's the crack with the... Um, with the, with the instructions and stuff, I've shown you that, I've shown you the teams. Uh, we'll go for a quick rundown through the club as well, because obviously with the money, I think in the last club tour we would have had about 50 million, 45 million, and there's a big chunk of that gone. Reason being, is this is what we've got. Lone FC, you love to see it, you guys on the YouTube channel especially. I don't know if the Twitch viewers enjoy Lone FC, but we do have Lone FC rocking on here. Um... It's not bad. It looks good. It looks good. Uh, we've got likes of uh, Socrates in there. And I'm, I was tempted to do him again, but I never. But Lone FC is pretty good. It saved me a lot of coins. Um, and you can see we've got Van Persie in there. So I thought that was a little bit of a coin kill. But we've got Ronaldo, Eusebio, Hullet as prime moment icons. Lehman, who I keep buying. We've actually got a Pat Pulled Hadji. You guys might have seen that video. Why is, there, why is there only one of him on the market? I might get rid of him some coins as well. We've got all the team of the years, bar one, which was our Pat pulled one, which is Virgil. We've got rid of him now. We've got all the other team of the years. Um, Hamdala, Wondolowski, basically discard tokens. We've got a few hero cards as well. My OCD goes a little bit messy when it gets to this stage because I don't believe them cards should be there. And I know it's done off... Uh, it's done of discard value, but it still triggers me that the team seasons are not next. But we've got Hazard, Lewandowski, Roy, Salah, Aguero, Aubameyang. We've got the complete Bundesliga, the complete uh, complete Bundesliga, complete Premier League, uh, and complete Turkish League. And no, we haven't got complete Turkish League. Liga Nos, and then who was the other weak league? Who was the other who was the other league guys which ran with the uh, Premier League? I don't know if... I, I've got all them as well. Portuguese League. And who was the other league? I don't even know. Saudi League. We've got all the Saudi League players as well. Um, and then obviously we're going to complete it as each team of season is released. So that's how we look. With all the team of seasons. Lala in there. A few of us as well. Basically going to be using the informs for uh, discard tokens and put into SBCs. That is the dream. And then you can see we get down to low-end players. Um, which are basically just fodder. More than anything. And uh, anyone else in there? I don't think there's anyone else in there. And then we'll go to Odegaard. Still got some one to watches. One to watches have been one of the worst um, worst additions to FIFA this year because the players haven't performed. I much prefer the way they do the live items uh, with the Champions League and stuff like that. And then we've got some high rated players which we're just going to use for SBCs. But I won't bore you with that. What I'll show you now is the specials, untradeable. So we've got the foot swap tokens including the Markovic, which are kept. Uh, we have got some untradeable Champions League cards, which were fortunate enough to have in the club, so we could do the UEFA League Champions League marquee matchups, and a lot of people were struggling um, to to complete them. A lot of League SBC players, two versions of Sancho when he messed up the SBC. Nothing new with the messing up SBCs. Uh, some foot swaps, Ibarbo, Weyer, Pulisic, Jao Felix... I didn't realize I had a red lenglet. Hmm. I've not been through this in a while. We've got some untradeable icons in there. More. We've got how many pages of untradeables have we got? We've probably got an absolute shed ton. And you'll see some team of seasons in here as well. There, we've got Manuel de Costa. No, that's not a team of season. Is that a team of the season? I believe that is a team of the season. Yeah, that is a team of the season. All the flashbacks, we've got all them. Uh Goretzka, Rabio, even though they've got better cards now. S-Wine's in there, updated uh, dynamic image of Martinez. We've got about seven versions of Royce. We've got about ten versions of uh, of Sergio Ramos as well. Uh, we've got some of the future stars there. Taliska, Brandt, uh, a lot of the weird foot birthday cards. Carlos Vela's one version. And we've also got his number two as well, which I believe is 90. Then we've got the untradeable team of seasons, which you get from objectives and stuff like that. And SBCs, Cruyff. 
I remember when I did that video for the icons, we got very lucky in the, was it mid-tier icons? I think they were the mid ones, we got very lucky. Were they mid-tier or baby? We got loads, we got loads. Um, Bamiang, all the player months and stuff. Now, the reason I do this, guys, is not to like... Um, I like I make content with this type of stuff, doing SBCs, doing stupidly expensive squad builders. So that's why I do everything. They, they were mid-icons, were they? Yeah, mid. Uh, so this is top tier, guys. We've got Werner, Ta, Morega, um, and the, 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 it's jumped up a lot now. João Felix is a red. Sergio Ramos is Champions League version. Uh, Bale is... What was this? Team of the Year nominee version. Sommer, which I think a lot of people have got anyway. Modric, Goretzka, Silva. They were pretty expensive SBCs. There's another Sergio Ramos. Um, Bobby Firmino, John, uh, Bobby Firmino uh, Jonas, Tellez Red. Parejo, who we packed yesterday. Robertson, untradeable. Why is he untradeable? Did I pack? I must have packed him in the guaranteed pack, didn't I? Uh, Red Laporte, Red Edison, Red Allison. Red Van Dyke, I think we finished top 100 that week. And then we've got Gordine as well. And we've also got two Van Dykes. We've got the player of the year and the uh, team of the season. And we've got that Sergio Ramos as well. So our best players we've got are the 96 ones. And it basically is Van Dyke and Gordine. And the rest is pretty good. And we've got an untradeable summer there as well. So that's a rundown of that. Now to finish off the video, guys, let's see if we can pack some more team of the season. I saved some... Uh... Imagine if I never did any of them SBCs, how many coins I would have. Instead of sinking them into there. We've got five 100k packs. So we'll see what we're able to grab from these. Uh, five 50k packs, weren't they? Not 100s. I'm, not, I'm just looking to use it as fodder, really. Ooh, cut. Mm, not bad. Uh, rest can go. We'll even discard that one. We've got four more packs to open. Not bad, though. Not bad. Let me know what you guys have been doing over team season period. Whether you've been sat there complaining about it. Using untradables, burn them into SBCs, and whether your team's changed dramatically. Now, the reason I ask that is because of how many people are playing the weekend league and their teams now. The teams I come up against now, this this uh, at this stage of FIFA, everyone's teams are pretty fantastic. The team's basically completely different, yeah. And literally, it was the Premier League team this season, which I think was uh, was the time in which everyone's team changed. After then. I even had like red cards, blue cards, stacked teams left, right and centre. But prior to that, you had like a weird bunch of teams. Now we do get a team this season. Oh no, we don't. We get an icon! Ha <laughs> ha! Whoa. English. Gerard, come on. Paul Skulls. 91. Damn, is that his prime? Is that his prime? Is that, that, that's his prime, isn't it? That's a prime icon. God damn. I don't know what the hell's going on my pat look today, guys, but welcome to the club, you ginger ninja. Let's go. We've got ginger ninja pole skulls. I don't know what's going on with packs today. That is crazy. How much is he worth? Oh, he's not really worth much, but, well, he is worth much, like 300k, but, damn. Hello. I'm more in shock than anything. Like, my pat look this morning has been crazy. And it might be because maybe the game knows I'm going away, but. A prime icon. I didn't expect that. I wanted Gerard, but I'm a Liverpool fan, so of course I'm going to want Gerard. Um, that's crazy. Loads of decent stuff in packs today. It's a shame I'm not really doing much for the next couple of days. Right, so there we are, guys. Nice uh, club tour, nice one down of custom tactics and stuff like that. Showing you the team, showing you all the players, and showing you packing an icon. Live, as well. Pretty crazy, guys. Leave a like here on the video. Subscribe if you're not as well. Check me out on Twitch, twitch.tv, forward slash And uh, we'll be back tomorrow with draft videos and uh, no rewards videos this week, guys, because I'm away. Um, but they will resume again next week. All right? Have a nice rest of your day. Bye-bye.